Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you, and part of the story here is the Albight Stadium by night, 60,000 capacity here. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's the Korea Republic up against Portugal. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Guerrero. Bruno Fernandes. Portugal pushing forward with options available. Can he play it in? Joao Cancelo. William Carvalho. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Well, we're focusing on a player who just seems to get better and better and better, Kyung Min Son. Stuart, what sort of performance might he produce? Defenders, Derek. Oh, look at this, Stuart, an opportunity. Terrific save. Well, prior to the last 20 years, Portugal were infrequent visitors to the World Cup. All that has changed. We always expect them to be... Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And he was in the right place to intercept... Wang Hee Chan. Well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Joao Cancelo. Bernardo Silva. This might have potential. He has time to play it over. Very quick thinking there. Son. William Carvalho. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Just the tackle that was needed. And room now out on the wing. And options in the centre. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Ruben Neves. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's with William Carvalho. And a poor ball. Leal. That's a splendid ball from Ronaldo. And a goal! 1 0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and I have to say, the finish is just brilliant from Bernardo Silva. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. Goal! And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? 
A chance maybe from the wide position. Now possibilities in the centre. Son. And Portugal regaining possession. Silva. Bruno Fernandes has it. And Portugal moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? A well, disappointing end to the move. Lee Jae Sung. Huang Ui Jo. And Lee Jae Sung with it. Moving forward effectively. A wonderful intervention. Fernandes Guerrero on the ball Rafael Leal nicely timed tackle the first half here comes to an end what a lot of Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Oh, great attacking play. Well, he couldn't worry the keeper with that effort. Cristiano Ronaldo. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Bernardo Silva. Leao. With a textbook interception. It's a good looking ball in behind. Son. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. Good technique displayed. No potential danger. Full credit. Wonderful stop. Bruno Fernandes. Cristiano Ronaldo. Guerrero. And unable to keep the ball. Wang He Chan. Good movement. How about the cross? Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Ronaldo. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Lee Jae Sung. Huang Ui Jo. The outcome is a goal kick here. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Ruben Neves. Joao Cancelo. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Cristiano Ronaldo. And Portugal moving the ball with purpose. And the cross smuggled away. Huang Hee Chan. 
They're showing good defensive judgment. Bruno Fernandes. A real opening now. And it's gone in. The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. We'll just take another look at this because the one two to get behind the defense is superbly worked and once he gets onto it he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique what an emphatic finish that is So the ball rolling again, 2-0 the score. Son. A very timely interception. Joao Cancelo. An awful lot of green space to run into. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Huang Ui Zhou. Jung. That's useful play. Son and played in. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Son. And we've entered the final five minutes. Poor pass. Wang Hee Chan. And it's Kim Min Jae. Jung. It's been aimed towards Hyung Min Son here. Oh, great defending. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And he's made headway. Ronaldo, well he read that brilliantly at the back He's in, and that will be that, the final whistle and it is a tale of misery for them not the result they were hoping for Stuart, your analysis well Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them just didn't look as sharp as normal and I don't think they deserved anything from the game they need to get a better performance in next time out and the shining light this evening, no doubt about it Bernardo Silva well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.